Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And we're very much looking forward to bringing you league action today. It's FCSB versus Rapid Bucharest. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Yeah, the same formation and the same sort of game plan. So this will all be about which individuals can get the better of their opponent. This will be a tough battle. And now they get the ball rolling. Olaru. Can he take the chance? Well, I know the home side are very proud of this particular statistic. They can boast the best defensive record in the league, Stuart. Well, they've been so well organised defensively. They press the ball from the front, the midfield players work really hard, and the defence are so disciplined. They're just so hard to break down. Well, visionary passing. Must be. Oh, a goal! There it is, and the crowd stunned to silence well as you can see the weight of the through ball is key to this goal but there's still plenty to do from here he hits it so well though lots of pace lots of power and the keeper just can't react in time it's a great strike And back underway, 1-0 it is. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. And the keeper got there, and comfortably. Florin Stefan. But wait a minute, that will not count. Well, that was tight, but he was just offside. It was a good finish, though. Julian Cristea. 
Marine. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Well, that'll be a free kick. Well, here it is again. The pass behind the defence is absolutely perfect. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? So, a level contest. 1-1. Andre Chiobanu. Surely! Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. Now, how about the short corner? And struggling to get the shot off. Oh, a vital interception. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Real chance. A superb chance, but he's failed the test. Well, you can see what he was trying to do, but he's missed the target. He should score there. Getting the ball forward. He could pick out a teammate. Bodies forward and the break looks on. All hands on deck. Chances on. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. The ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. And we are going to have two additional minutes. Valentin Kostaki. And there it is, the half-time whistle.
So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Now oh, that pass easy on the eye. Well now in a dangerous position. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop it. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So there it is. 3-1 the current scoreline here. And they stopped them in their tracks. Valentin Kostaki. It has to be high echelon goalkeeping there. Can someone get on the end of this? The high press was very much on. Dario Solaru. A running room in the wide position. But I think just lost his focus for a second and a throw in conceded. Well, the visitors have controlled possession, as you can see, but they aren't doing enough with it. Oh, look at this, Stuart, an opportunity. And it's come off the keeper and thumped away. And he takes on the shot. Well, really calm, composed goalkeeping there. It certainly was on the second attempt. It was the first save that really stood out. That was a brilliant piece of goalkeeping. himself up the ball and time for the change now He's driven in the corner. Struggling to get it away. Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. But a crucial intervention inside the box. So a throw in here. Plenty of support here, and the ball's gone. Well, far from the ideal pass. A chance to whip it in. 
Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Radunovic. Sorescu. Can he make it count? Well, just fractionally wide. Good strike. So a personnel change then. Well, the seconds are ticking away and the home side in control. Stuart, what have you made of this? Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play and they've created some really... Oh, good... it's developing nicely for them here. They've got themselves back into it. A lifeline in this game. And this could be a dramatic finale. Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place, but give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. Well, the action underway once more, and no shortage of entertainment. 3-2. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. There will be three minutes added on at the end. Did well to win the ball back. The delivery, and you need your defender to take charge. The referee blows for full time, it ends in a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, before the game, we talked about their defensive qualities, but today it was all about their ability to create chances that were so impressive. And key to that was their positional rotation, which caused the opposition all sorts of problems. It was a real joy to watch. Visionary pop.
Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And only eight teams left in this cup competition. We're at the quarter-final stage. It's FCSB against Uta Arad. Well, Derek, these two teams will be fully aware of what's at stake. A place in the semi-final of this great competition. It should be feisty, it should be entertaining, and it should be full of quality. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, although we have it down as a 4-5-1, it's actually more likely to be a 4-2-3-1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10 and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. And the match is underway. <laughs> Electing to cross into the center. Now, looking dangerous here. They might be able to get in now. Oh, good work by the keeper. Dejan Sorescu. He's given us away. And he's broken free. Surely. And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. Oh, he looks threatening. And reading it absolutely superbly. And that's it, the final whistle, and the hosts will go through. Yes, it was tight, but in my view, they were slightly the better team and just about deserved their victory.
but most of those players will be absolutely drained, both physically and mentally, because that was a gruelling contest between two well-matched teams. This should be something to savour. The best defence in the league up against the freest scoring team in the league. Who will come out on top? Stay tuned. We'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And on this Halloween, I don't think we're going to be putting the frighteners on anyone, given the game that's about to commence. It's Universitatia 1948, and they take on FCSB. Well, Derek, my treat is just being next to you, because this should be a great game today. You're too kind, as always, Stuart. Well, many talking points coming into the game. The hosts have the best defensive record in the league, while their guests have been the most prolific in front of goal. Stuart, something has to give. Well, you're absolutely right, Derek. These fans, though, will know their team will be tested today, but up to now, their defensive work has been excellent. I'm intrigued to see who's going to win this one. The initial 11 today for the hosts. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated and it could be difficult for them. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, it's a 4 3 3 formation with a centre forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. And so the battle commences. Marquet. Danger averted for now. And a fine tackle. From Durman. Can he give them the lead? Not out of the woods yet. Well, nothing comes of it.
Well, he strayed offside just as it looked promising. And he keeps going. An alert piece of defending. Coman. Now potential danger. Marquet. Francois Marquet. And they have possession again. Will he find the net? Could be. And the keeper had the measure of it. <laughs> Played over. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Asamoah. Can he finish? Tenacious tackling. Excellent defending there. Risto Radunovic. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. And disappointingly, not even close to hitting the target there. Yeah, he was looking to open up his body, guide it into the corner, but he's got it all wrong. It's a poor attempt in the end. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Coman has a go and blocked for now. A chance to nudge in front. Corner kick here. <whistles> and over it comes. Well, not cleared away completely. Able to get his body in the way. And snuffing out the danger. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. That is how to apply the pressure. Good use of advantage by the referee. Asamoah. I just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. Dario Solaru. Coman. It did look on for them, but not to be. Van Durman. Determined defending. This looks threatening, and the alarm bells are ringing. Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. And he's fired over the corner. The clearance wasn't decisive. Well, they can bring it out now. So the referee blows his whistle for half-time. A tense contest so far, Stuart. What have you made of the visitors? Well, after talking about how good their attacking play is, they've just been below their best today. But let's give some credit to the opposition. They've had a game plan. It's worked well. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Or can they be creative from here? Could go ahead! Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off!
Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here's the replay. What a superb volley this is. He strikes it so cleanly and he times it perfectly. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Van Durman. It's neat passing, confidence on the ball. This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. Taken short. I think the referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. Into the box it goes. Well, there it is. The away side haven't had as much of the ball, but that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. Well, that's right, preserving the lead and doing it really well. And will it be the leveller? Wonderful challenge, but the chance is still on. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Defenders need to cover. Could cross it in here. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. Can he take advantage? Spectacular save. Top-class goalkeeping. And time for the change now. Well, still behind here, but only due to some incredible goalkeeping. Surely it's only a matter of time if they keep piling on the pressure like this. Now he must favour the cross. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. And they know they need to stop him. Well denied by the woodwork this time. Well, the keeper was beaten, but the woodwork wasn't. That's a sharp chance. Over the touchline for a throw-in. What can they do to stop him running at them? And they deal with the threat this time. Well, not quite accurate enough, but it was a close thing. Cross fired over. It might still be problematic. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end.
Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left, and just one goal between the sides. This could be it. Blocked it brilliantly. Oh, a smart save, and that keeps them in with a chance. Well, there's still a bit of time left. Can this inspire them to go and get the equaliser? Substitution time it is here. And he's fired over the corner. In it goes to increase their advantage. And will that be the goal that ends up securing it for them? Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. A message delivered from the referee to the fourth official. Three minutes on the board. And he's broken free. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Well, not the best clearance. Threat over for now, it seems. And there it is, the full-time whistle here, and it's a victory for the visitors. Well, this was always going to be a test of their attacking qualities, but I thought they were brilliant today. They totally outplayed a very good defensive side. And the match is on.